excited because I'm going to one of my favorite places in Toronto. And the best thing is, I'm going today with one of my favorite people in the whole wide world. And meet Priyanshi. <laughs> Priyanshi, how do you feel? being a part of my youtube channel <laughs> i can't wait to show you guys all the incredible spots we'll be exploring today but before i can start functioning i need a little caffeine fix so let me take you to one of my favorite little cafes called cassette how cute is this store so we've got our coffee now let's catch the bus and head to our first stop for the day sunny side beach and we are finally here it's beautiful it's a little chilly today a more chilly than we expected but look at this view the shimmering blue waters the sound of crashing waves and the refreshing breeze this is just what my soul needed let's take a stroll along the shoreline and soak in the beauty of this mesmerizing view i've seen a lot of change been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same as they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same as they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago right now we are freezing even though we are outside so we decided to sit a little away from the water but look at this there are two people in the water right now as we speak cheers <laughs> so we've set our table up we've got our snacks and munchies however we are too cold right now to eat so now we'll just do some of our gossip sessions the calming waters The sail was passing by and the skyline of Toronto in the distance. It's a picture perfect day. But what makes this all even better are these heartfelt conversations with your best friend. We are chatting and laughing our hearts out, sharing our dreams and fears, and somehow knowing that no matter what happens, we'll always be there for each other. There's also a cute little cafe by the beach called Sunnyside Pavilion Cafe where you can grab a bite to eat or get some drinks. Additionally, their washrooms are open to all, not just their guests, and they are very clean and well maintained in case you need to use the washroom while on the beach. It is said that in the early 1900s, the city of Toronto saw the potential of this cute little beach. They brought in truckloads of sand, expanded the shoreline. The beach is perfect for sunbathing, picnicking, cycling along the trail, and creating wonderful memories with your loved ones. You can find beach volleyball courts, soccer fields, and even a swimming pool nearby. Or you can simply rent a kayak or a canoe and explore the waters on your own. There's also a children's park where your kids can play. while you relax by the beach and if you are a pet parent don't worry the beach is pet friendly you can bring your fur babies along and they can enjoy the waters too <laughs> So 
we decided to walk from our spot and now we've come to another side of the beach and yeah this is the view here that bird right there was about to attack me so i ran away <laughs> and yeah so i think it's about to be sunset very soon At your own risk, Priyanshi, are you sure? Oh my god, that guy is literally going. And that too with a baby, man, guts. I think he's scouting for his target. Ki. No, he's not telling us that. Ah, very true, man. Came out. Oh my god, I think yes, he's doing that. And came out. You were so right, no? <laughs> I have a feeling too. It's like enough, man. Yeah. Ranshi, how's your day going? Are you yes. having fun? Yes, so much fun. <laughs> so, much fun. so much fun. And that uh, the, uh, scene Let's go really... before he attacks us. So, Priyanshi, yes. tell me your views about the place. Views about the place. It's calm, it's peaceful, mm -hmm. and it is so pretty. And what don't you like about the place? The, the flies. The yeah. flies. Yeah. <laughs> Yes. Oh my god. Oh. See, he went back into. Oh, yeah. So true, man. It's a yeah, he's so territorial, right? Exactly. He ensured that everybody's gone. This beach was crowded. Yeah. Oh, there are more coming. See? Oh, look at this cutie, man. So, what should we do for dinner, Priyachi? Um, let's do Pizza. something which is hot. Like, ramen? <laughs> oh, like, okay, let's do the, let's do ramen. Oh ramen my god, I'm like, craving ramen now because yeah. it's a little cold and and it's like the last few days of being chilly, yeah. so we should just have ramen. Yeah, exactly. Ramen. I need that warm. Yes, ramen is yes. like our favorite thing to do is I have ramen. ramen. We are both obsessed with ramen. Yes. <laughs> when I, when I fall sick, I get happy because that's my excuse to eat ramen. Ramen. So, yeah. Yes. Ramen is the best thing if you have not tried it. There are so many tons of amazing ramen places in Toronto. So just go and just like have a great bowl of ramen before the summer comes. Yeah. Ramen, I feel it's like a hug in a bowl. Yeah, it's like there's nothing so soul filling than ramen. Yep. Now it's time for our next stop. Just a short distance away is the Humber River Bridge, where you can take a leisurely stroll and enjoy the picturesque views. However, according to me, the best thing about this destination is the journey. You can walk up to the bridge through the Martin Goodman Trail. This scenic trail stretches along Toronto's waterfront, offering stunning views of the city's skyline. Whether you're walking, jogging or cycling, it's a fantastic way to explore the area. <laughs> Just like we planned, we ended this perfect day with steaming bowls of yummy, comforting ramen. 
Yes, we come to the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And I hope you like this video. And if you did, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.